Anyway, ball was so rudely interrupted because my my phone was on uh, the part where it saves where it's saving the video on my uh, phone instead of the stupid SD card. I wonder why that shit kept running out on me. Exactly. Fuck it. Damn, bitch is huge. Wow. It doesn't look that good on my phone, but it's uh, so uh I like guy to hit me up you know what I'm saying just let me know some shit he told me uh he told me that I have to do I have to do DMT uh, so you know it's a uh, just like before when I fucking had to do fucking G when I did a uh, clear he told me that he told me to do that shit it was something that I didn't I didn't feel like doing I didn't fucking want but it doesn't really fucking matter you know what I'm saying if I'm a fucking addict if uh if say if you're an addict and you're like his God is tells you you know what I'm saying he's gonna tell you to do all the shit that you don't want to do or you don't like the shit that you like fuck oh, man should I do this again? Because all the other times I can fuck. So it just showed me that I could fucking that I did that shit for so long, and I and the amount that I did was like ungodly. It had everybody freaking out, and I was just fucking fine. You know what I'm saying? It's like a uh, shit that I was doing would have made a nigga's eyes and hair and everything fall out, and they would have just fucking you know they would have fucking just been able to say gah for the rest of the gah gah. <laughs> Gaga, <laughs> that's all they, and they could be able to say if they were doing it. They took one of the shots that I was taking, you know. Uh, that shit was like, that shit was like syrup. It was like fucking, yeah. That shit was so thick. It was like, it was just syrup, fucking shooting into my motherfucking bank, cool to the top, to the tip top, you know. Uh, So he showed me that I could do that shit, and then when he told me to stop, I just stopped. And when I I just stopped cold turkey, fucking everything, no detox, no fucking nothing. I didn't fucking sleep. I, I slept for like a hour, like every fucking night for a, for a month, you know. But I was just fine, shit. I fucking I was tired. I fucking felt good. I fell asleep for an hour. Uh, wow, jumped up, go to work, so I was the shit. Uh. Which made, makes a lot of sense now because the shit is not real. She's not, uh. All this shit is. It is. Let me see. Is it virtual? Virtual? It's not real. It's just fucking simulation. You know? How. In a video game, does a guy, you know, really get fucking hungry? Or is it really. So, uh, what was his What did he tell me? He told me. He told me that uh, only the fucking. That at this point, only the. Uh, a motherfucker. The brave. The bravest motherfuckers will fucking do that shit. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, uh. That once you come to that, you come to the fucking, uh. Understanding and that, you know. And the, and the peace because you know that everything is it's, God has everything under control there's nothing a motherfucker needs to worry about at all you know what I'm saying because motherfuckers are going to be like hey how do you know it's God that's so he's like man just probably fuck Satan you know God wouldn't tell you to do drugs <laughs> hey motherfucker you, here you go again acting like you know God like fucking like you guys are homies you used to kick it back in a day you grew up together you know what I'm saying you don't know shit you don't know shit, motherfucker. He, uh, he even told me that fucking this is the part where I learned that there's no, there's, there is no fucking, uh, you know, and I'm, I'm becoming, I'm it's starting like the fucking flicker in and out, you know, the knowing that there's no right or wrong.
there's no, uh, there's no right or wrong, there's no good or bad, there's just, uh, you know, there's just something, I can't fucking, just fucking, you know, so, uh, that's the point of fucking, uh, I have no, no idea what the fucking point is, you know, but I just can't wait to fucking, I can't wait to fucking see, you know what I'm saying, because, lo and behold, the fucking one time, I mean, when he tells me that shit, he tells me that shit, you know what I'm saying, uh, he didn't tell me he he told me he's psychedelic. And it's a tool. It's a tool to be used. So, uh, and then boom. Then I fucking, uh, told somebody about that shit. Hey, man, fucking, you know, fucking, it's crazy, man. I told this kid at work. Yo, God's supposed to be, you know what I'm saying? Told me I gotta do fucking psychedelic and shit. This nigga said, I got DMT at home right now. I don't fucking even want to, he said, I don't fuck with that shit. He's like, we fucked with it a little bit and then fucking everybody's fucking terrified so nobody wants to do it no more. So it's just sitting there. Boom, you know. How many times would a motherfucker have to fucking, uh, if somebody was like, I want to do DMT or psychedelic or some shit or some mushrooms or any of that shit. How many, man, a motherfucker, you're going to have to fucking ask him. Ask a, gr a grip of motherfuckers before you can find that shit. You know what I'm saying? There's no fucking way that I could just pop out like we're doing a car and I just fucking like hey man God told me I had to do this and he just said hey well fuck I got that shit at home right now I mean, I got you. you know fucking it's just sitting there because we did it already motherfuckers you know the experiences we had no we don't want to fucking do that shit it's too fucking scary he said it was the most terrifying thing he ever fucking went through I was like cool so he's got me you know I don't know when you know what I'm saying but I know I'm supposed to do it in, in the fucking uh I'm supposed to do it in, in like a mountain, I like a mountain or some shit like that, I don't know, you know, but I can't wait to see, I can't wait to see, it always gives you like that fucking, uh, that nervous, kind of like a, a nervous feeling, you know, like, I like that good nervous feeling, you know, like going somewhere that's going somewhere that you know is going to be fucking super fucking exciting and and but you don't know what it's going to be like, you know, and you're fucking like kind of imagine it, you know, what I'm saying, what the fuck is it? What the, why the fuck do I have to take this shit for? What is it going to what is it going to fucking what's going to happen? Because I know, you know, what I'm saying I know that that time and, and space is this shit's not fucking real, you know, what I'm saying so, fuck, man, am I going to fucking take this shit because this motherfucker said you know what I'm saying like in the real in this in this in the third dimension this shit only lasts six minutes you know what I'm saying but fuck man I've done some fucking salvia back in the day and the fucking 15 minutes that they said I was fucking high or five minutes they said I was high or whatever the fuck felt like I was fucking gone for like fucking for like hours and shit you know what I'm saying and uh, am I gonna fucking be gone for fucking a week or some shit and then and only six minutes pass it right here? You know, it's gonna be weird. And I'm not worried. Yeah, I'm not worried about it. I'm just fucking excited. I'm excited. Uh, I think uh, it has to do with... I think it has to do with uh, what, it, what I'm fucking leaning to is that I've been... Uh, I've already been awakened to a certain amount, to a certain degree, to where, uh, you know, the shit that other people, if that, that most people you're going to fucking, if you find out certain shit, they're not going to fucking take it well. They're not going to take it well. You know, they're, it's just, you know. After fucking the shit that I fucking, that I've been through and that I'm probably conditioned for since fucking my past fucking eight lives were fucking, were super fucking, were full of fucking pain and fucking, you know, and uh, suffering that I, uh, you know, that I could be like, oh, what? It's like, oh, okay, cool. Oh, God, cool. You know what I'm saying? This is that. Oh, cool. You know what I'm saying? Which is some. Shit that the motherfuckers are not going to fucking, would not fucking handle. You know, wouldn't be able to fucking handle, you know. They wouldn't take it. They would, uh... 
It would be pretty fucking scary, probably, for a lot of people to find out certain things. And to know that this whole, this whole thing that we think is life, that we call life in reality is not fucking real. And what, you know, I, I uh, when I fucking had that salvia fucking shit, it was fucking, you know, oh, everything was part of God's plan, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I can remember it so good, but... Like my fucking little brothers when I got out of prison were like, like, hey man, fucking hit the, sal- the salvia extract, you know what I'm saying? You gotta rip it, it's way better than fucking shrooms. And I was like, cool. You know what I'm saying? I love mushrooms. Uh, the motherfucker said, uh, so it's like, okay, well we fucking hit, when you hit it, we're gonna push you in the door, you know what I'm saying? I was like, all right, cool. Push you inside, you know, it's like fucking, to rip and fucking when I went in, when I fucking started to go in the door, it was like, like fucking kind of like on the matrix you know what i'm saying like like the fucking and and the, the one picture that i stopped at was like like fucking went on for fucking forever like just a bunch of fucking pictures of that same flash of me going through the door you know and then then i was uh i was there but i didn't i i just remember fucking thinking that i was like i felt like i was a page in between a book which is Hey, hey, and, and what's fucking crazy is that there's a movie Interstellar. This movie Interstellar that I've seen recently, this motherfucker's uh, when he's he's uh, when he meets the fucking the the fucking you know the dimensional beings, and they're uh, and he's in that fucking little space where it's like fucking in between space and time, and it's a fucking uh, it's like a tesseract, you know. He's in the tesseract and shit. That's fucking shit that I was in. Like I was the fucking like I was a, a fucking one of those little slices in there, and all I can remember was that I didn't know what I was before that I didn't remember being a human. That I was like, and every time I turned to look. Like I was a slice and I turned it was like a bunch of slices and it sounded like fucking so many flipping pages in a like in a book like a, every time I fucking like like I was flipping some cards like like every time I turned like and I was looking back and forth and I just kept and there was just a bunch of different a bunch of slices of the same you know and I was like I just remember thinking like and I was kind of sad I was like man what the fuck I was like I could have swore I was something but I don't remember what I was you know what I'm saying I I was something. Fuck, man, I, I thought I was something, but I guess I'm just a fucking piece of something. It fucking sucks. You know what I'm saying? I thought I was my own thing, but now, you know, whatever I thought I was, I didn't remember that I was a human. I just remembered that I was some, I was something. I was a some, you know, I didn't even remember that I was a somebody. I just remembered I was, I was something that was something that was separate. But no, I'm just a fucking piece of, I'm a piece of something. Piece of something, you know what I'm saying? That's big. I'm just one little piece of fuckers. Like I fucking felt like I was a, like I was a cell or some shit. Like a fucking cell in a, in a, you know, I was a piece. Which now all makes sense to me now, you know what I'm saying? Like I was fucking, I seen through, you know, I, I see through, I seen through and seen that it was a fucking, uh, you know, that we're all one. We're just a fucking, we're all just a piece, you know, of God. Uh, and and I, I was terrified of that shit too. I was I'm hella terrified. I was hella terrified of that shit. I was I'll never. I wouldn't even give that shit to my worst enemy. I'll never. I wouldn't even trick my worst enemy to hit that motherfucking salvia shit. <laughs> you know, when, it was crazy too. If you just take a little hit of that shit too, it gives you this feeling like like you got tall, like but like space and 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 uh, space and and shit is coming in is rushing towards you, you know what I'm saying? And it kind of makes you feel tall and long, you know, it's fucking with just a little hit, you know, and it wears off, but yeah, I, I can't wait to see this DMT thing because these guys, this guy said, uh, he said that they, they did that shit and they were fucking, and that they just were like fucking, he said that it was the scariest thing he ever went through. He's like, man, things I've seen, you know, I've seen all kinds of fucking Hallucinations. I was like, you ain't see hallucinations. Nothing, motherfucker. You seen the real shit. This, 
what we're seeing now is a hallucination, motherfucker. We're living in a hallucination, you know? Fucking that shit just lets you see what's real. Anyway, that shit is, uh, that's what's on my plate. I'm about to bust through to the other side. I, 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 I've, uh, noticed that shit too, that a lot of fucking different, uh, I wonder if it's, if that's a part of my, uh, you know, awakening, of awakening, you know, ascension is to do that because I've heard, uh, I've heard multiple fucking people, like, uh, people that, you know, that third dimension motherfuckers call famous superstars, you know what I'm saying? Uh, to say, uh, give their accounts of when they took DMT, you know? So I think that is a fucking part of, uh, of the ascension is, is doing, uh, the DMT. And it's fucking, it's even fucking more fucking badass to even know to like fucking, like, if, if your friend tells you, man, try this shit, it's badass, you know what I'm saying? See, check this shit out, man. That just gonna make you fucking trip out, it's crazy ass shit or whatever, fuck, that was cool, but... That's got nothing on if God tells you, look, I want you to fucking take some psychedelics, man. Fucking, no, I need you to fucking, you know, it's a need, it's a, it use it as a tool, you know what I'm saying? It's as a tool, you know what I'm saying? To fucking uh, expand my fucking consciousness and shit. You know, so uh, he's like, yeah, I want you to do that shit. You know? And it's not no fucking, with, with the fucking, uh, with the, when he was telling me to do the fucking, uh, clear. I had to fucking ask him, like, are you sure? Like, are you sure? Are you sure? I'm like, a fucking, now, I'm like, I don't even have to fucking ask that shit. You know? Like, because why would I be scared to stick needles in my arm? Why would I be scared to do anything? Why would I be scared to drink gasoline? You know, I'm not scared of shit. You know, everything, uh, God has everything under control. And I trust him 100 fucking percent, you know, so why would I fucking be scared of anything? So this mass, this massive awakening of like everybody or whatever fucking happened. I can't wait. You know, oh yeah. They're supposed to be, I don't know how it's supposed to work. I just know that they're supposed to be that motherfuckers that is, uh, that I already went through this fucking process and shit. This process of evolution. Are going to fucking. We're going to be able to explain if we haven't explained things already, like uh, by you know videos and shit that are the videos that are made by the people that God had made have made you know. God had them make them, had me make them, had everybody make them. God. Every word that came out of everybody's mouth was designed by God. And everybody who sees the videos that they're supposed to see and the parts they're supposed to see and the words they're supposed to hear are supposed to see them because God designed all that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like everything is fucking... God has everything under control. There's no fucking need for fucking thinking and worrying and, and uh, hoping like, oh shit, did I do this right? Oh fuck, I did something wrong. Oh shit, am I supposed to do this? Am I supposed to do that? Hey, am I supposed to fucking, am I supposed to carry these crystals around? You know what I'm saying? As they say, if I carry crystals, you'll wear crystals around my neck. Or if I fucking meditate and do this fucking shit and do that shit, you know what I'm saying? Like fucking, I don't do any of that shit. I don't do any of that shit, you know? 
because uh, that's uh, when people say that shit, it just uh, it doesn't resonate with me. You know, it doesn't resonate with me. You know, or like people would like say to fucking read the Bible, it doesn't resonate with me. People say to uh, to pray, ask God to help me with this, or pray God for strength and shit. Like it doesn't resonate. It doesn't resonate with me. Why would I fucking have to ask God for anything? If I got trust in Him, I don't fucking. You know, He's got everything under control. What the fuck do I gotta ask for shit? I don't gotta ask nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like that'd be that'd be like fucking. That'd be like me insult, insulting the creator by fucking, hey, can you think you could just give me some strength? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, dude, he got every fucking thing under control, man. Every fucking thing. You don't got to ask him for shit, nigga. All you got to do is fucking say, thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Every fucking second of the day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for everything. I know there's not enough. It's not fucking any of much or uh, it's not much motherfuckers that are that think the same way or that are that same uh, have that same have that same understanding. There's levels to the she. Hell yeah, bitch. I don't gotta go to work for fucking two motherfucking days. I wonder what's on. I have to do something with some kind of art shit. I know that, you know, that I'll be doing because they have me buying all, buying all kinds of shit. It's funny that when I fucking go and I'll go, fuck, boom, Hobby Lobby, and I'll just have a certain amount. I'll just fucking grab a little handful of the crumb of money and crumb of tips, you know, and I'll go in Hobby Lobby and then boom, 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 the shit that I'll go walk to and I'll just grab boom, 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 boom. I don't know why I need that shit. You know, I'm not thinking about it. I didn't go there thinking about it. I just fucking, I'm in the passenger seat, you know, God's doing what he does. And uh, then I go to the fucking counter to pay for the shit, you know, and, and I'll, I'll fucking be, uh, I'll be like, Right on the money, you know what I'm saying? Like fucking, I'll get like five cents change back or something from everything I, I fucking got from what I have. That's just, it's crazy. But then I, I don't know what all that shit's for, you know what I'm saying? He doesn't tell me no shit from the future, you know? He's only in the present, you know? So when I'm supposed to do something with whatever I'm supposed to do with it, it'll happen. He'll tell me right, he'll let me know right when it's supposed to go. He don't, he don't fucking, you know what I'm saying? He won't tell me, uh, he won't tell me, you know, fucking, look, you're going to paint this shit fucking in like, two days, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, I got paid before, I was like, well, maybe I'm supposed to paint, but I just wasn't, you know, didn't fucking feel it. And then fucking, like, a day later, then boom, then I felt it. You know, like, so it's never no fucking nothing. Nothing is on when I try to think of it as shit myself. It's not, uh, it's, a, it's not, uh, it's not the way it flies. Man, I'm so fucking tired. Uh, those motherfuckers at the fucking car wash. All those fucking people spent all those fucking money, all that fucking money to wash their fucking stupid fucking cars. To wash their stupid fucking cars. You know? All that fucking money, man. Fucking, fucking 30 fucking dollars every fucking car, you know what I'm saying? For fucking. All this fucking fucked up shit, bro. Kids fucking starving. They're fucking cookies. Spend that money when they could have just fucking as easily as washed it their damn selves and used that fucking money to fucking help people. Yep. Fuck. Fuck. 
fuck with you. Put a banana. I'm gonna fuck with you. Put a banana and everybody's terrifying. Fuckers, these two bitches know how to fucking make no fucking donuts out of something else other than fucking eggs and milk and bitch ass shit. Light security. You already know what it is. I'm fucking tired as fuck. Oh, good to God. And, uh, yeah. I need to... Just don't be a fucking dumbass your whole life. think that you know something, the more stupid that you are. You don't know shit. You don't know shit. You don't know God. And yeah. That's about it. You know. You're never gonna know anything until you realize you don't know shit. That's what Oh damn what the fuck is that? She's you motherfuckers don't even know it's in the fucking sky and shit. Them niggas is just fucking flying around up there. You don't even fucking... They don't even have to hide and shit. You know what I'm saying? These motherfuckers are so dumb. Fucking Your face is fucking planted in your fucking phones and shit. Alright. Love, light, energy to everybody and eat a dick.